I scraped out all of the old silicone that had yellowed. And if anyone knew of a good silicone to use, it would be Misha at Winnie Design. So I gave him a call and he recommended this one. I ran up to the store and bought that as well as some painter's tape. And if you've ever used silicone before, you know this stuff can be nasty. I wanted to make sure that the line was absolutely perfect even though it dries clear. So I put painter's tape on both sides of where the silicone would be going. And then to smooth it out, I just took a popsicle stick and sprayed a little bit of soapy water on it. This helped me completely smooth out the silicone without having it to stick to anything. And then I just removed that painter's tape and then did the same exact thing to the inside. And since I removed all of the silicone in between the wall and the floor tile, I did the same exact thing to here. And luckily the silicone in the corners of the wall was still in really good condition, so I didn't worry about redoing that. But you would normally want a silicone there as well. I also did the bottom of the fixed panel there, and then the last thing was to install this drip edge for the shower door. I siliconed the bottom and applied tape to hold it down overnight. 